with us from Williams Arena tonight. The opening possession to the Pirates, and off we go from Greenville. East Carolina led, of course, by Jaden Gardner, but watch out for Tristan Newman as well. Newman, uh, Newman and Gardner, the highest scoring duo that returns in the American Athletic Conference this season. And quickly from the corner, a good start for the Pirates as Robinson White triples it in. Up in the lane. He's a guy that is so versatile, especially on the offensive end. You can see the power of the dunk. Sims, oh, nearly had a chance for a four-point play, but he'll shoot three. Just a junior, a native of Charlotte. And talking with Coach Siddle this round and play with a lot of freedom. So you can play down low or come out to the outside and get your shots. Season and Seahawks went two and one out in Nashville. Floater as well. Uh, the hesitation, the ball handling. I mean, right there, moving defenders with that little head fake and going in, and he's looking for a shot off the bench. Sims at the line for the one and one. first half well and that's the thing I think they're gonna look back and say hey we had an opportunity here with Gardner out of the ball game you know I think on the defensive end with his height his range athleticism you know, that's another area where he can really try to shut down his opponents with his defense we we're talking about East Carolina's defense a moment ago Jay Pirates only giving up 56 points a game. That's the second fewest in the American so far this year. And Sims with a triple, his first field goal of the night, and out, and the Seahawks the other way. Sims with just one field goal tonight. Nice ball movement by UNCW. The pressure by ECU, Chris. I mean, they're all over Boggs. Just the intensity they're playing with, ECU. Just moving their feet, nowhere to go for Sims. And a bit of a bailout foul there for Sims. Way down to four on that possession. Sims, 75% from the line, this two for their last 14 from the field. If you're UNCW, two minutes to go in the half. Where are you hoping to be at the end of this two minutes? Well, I think you want to get into single digits. I think that's a realistic goal. You haven't been efficient from the outside, so I think you need to continue to attack the rim and try to get to the line. So, of course, Sims pulls up and hits a three. Yeah, and I mean, that'll work. It's getting difficult for him down low. Newton can't connect with the triple. Uh, both teams, you know, for ECU, just trying to find some rhythm there. and Kind of a new lineup. Suggs was out for the ball game as well in the first half with foul trouble, too. And how about the finish that time for UNCW? Seahawks still how good it was in the first half. I think they need to create some easy scoring opportunities from their defense. Seahawks three of the first six from the field. Pirates nearly forced the turnover. Sims on the wing. A big three for the Seahawks. And that was good close. Jackson denied that time nicely by Bowen. Harvey has had the hot hand for the Seahawks. Now we got a mismatch out here. The quickness of Sims on to Bow. Look for Sims. Try to attack and use it against him. Sims to the rim and we'll head to the line. The line with a chance to give UNCW what would be their first lead since it was 17 15. And the Seahawks. Carolina, only two for the Seahawks. And then they've just been connecting their shooting percent. This is Newton. Fall away. What a tough shot. Good defense by UNCW. Sims in transition. And will head to the line. It was Suggs who took a nut to inch closer in this game. And now, Chris, we've got a one point ball game. It's going to be an outstanding finish. It's true tonight in what is the 67th meeting between ECU and UNCW. Seahawks by three with two minutes left. Contested shot. And it comes to Sims. Eight seconds separating shot clock and game clock. Sims against Miles. Eight to shoot. Sims to the hole. Tied again. Pirates will her can. 
New career high for J.J. Miles, 22 in the game. Pirates with the big lead. Is this a must-score possession for UNCW? Uh, I mean, they need to get some rhythm, some confidence here in the overtime. I don't think they have to score, but they need to get off a good shot. Sims from 15. Big answer. There it is. I mean, you're best, but now taking over with hustle, with defense, creating turnovers, and having fast-break opportunities. 82-75. Pirates. ECU looking to go to 4-0 and for just the fourth time in program history, but Sims not going quietly for the season. You know, for them, you know, the disappointment's going to be the first half. But for both sides, the coaching point is both teams are going to want to play a full 40 minutes and just continue to improve. Sims still attacking, and Gardner whistled for the foul. Third on Gardner. ECU picked ninth in the American. I mean, I think this is a team that's going to finish much higher than that season. Already four in double figures for ECU tonight. You know, we talked about who's going to step up and be the playmaker. Sims on the wing. A big three for the Seahawks. And that was good close.